The actuator and pivot lever are located at the front of the intake manifold, red arrow, and cannot be accessed without removing the intake from the engine. Please see the link at the end of this video for intake manifold removal step-by-step -step instructions. With the manifold out, you can see the complete tumbler or swirl flap system. The actuator, yellow arrow, the pivot lever arm, red arrow, and the tumble flap armatures, the green arrows. The repair kit includes a new actuator with a metal, not plastic arm, red arrow, new hardware, a pivot ball and push nut, the yellow arrow, and an aluminum pivot lever, green arrow. This photo illustrates the most common failure. The plastic ball joint breaks off of the pivot lever arm, as indicated by the red arrow. Use a small flathead screwdriver and carefully pry the push nut off of the stud that holds the actuator in place. Red arrow. Slide the actuator off the mount and separate the rubber hose from the hard plastic line, as indicated by the red arrow. The actuator in the kit comes with a new rubber section of hose, so you can carefully cut the old one off rather than risk breaking the hard line. Using a flathead screwdriver, carefully pry both flap connecting arms from the ball cups on the pivot arm, red arrows. Use a T30 torque and remove the pivot bolt, red arrow. Use care as these are held in with Loctite and usually strip when removed. With the actuator and pivot lever off, check for the condition of the pivot lever mount. Install the new metal pivot lever while putting a small amount of silicone grease on the ball cup and the pivot mounting bolt surface, red arrows. Place a small amount of blue Loctite on the pivot bolt threads. Install and torque to 7 to 8 foot-pounds. Make sure to clean the swirl flaps of any carbon buildup before reinstalling the manifold in the engine, as indicated by the red arrows. With everything installed and cleaned, you are ready to reinstall the intake manifold. Thanks for watching. Click here to view the original article along with hundreds of other DIY content for your car.